Make sure you grab your cup of coffee and join me for this nice relaxing yarn unboxing. So anyways guys, thank you so much for joining me. This new video is just a nice quick yarn revealing for you all. So this new yarn is by Hot Knit Yarns. I brought from her before. Before I show you this new yarn, I will like to show you what I've already done with it since this is gonna be a little bit different because I already have some stuff worked up. One of them being a new video that's gonna come out soon because I'm almost done with that garment. If you've seen my post about the Halloween yarn, this is by Hot Knit Yarn. The back is called Beetlejuice. It has purple reflex, not reflex, but like hints of purples and grays in there. And then the Halloween yarn is orange, purples, and lime greens. And so this is all in Hot Knit Yarns Jimmy Sock Weight, which is 75% superwash merino, 25% nylon, uh, 463 yards, and it is a fingering weight. So it does take a while to work this stuff up. <laughs> Another one of hers is this one. I've undone and redone, and I'm still not sure what I'm gonna do with it. I'm probably gonna undo it. This one is two more of her colorways. This is Rain on Summer Grass and boombox uh but yeah so these three are from hot knit yarns they're all gonna have their separate videos but this one's gonna come up first i'm almost done with this one there's that and then i have the back paneling here so this is where the shoulder is gonna be looks pretty cool huh cool so let's get down to it let's get down to some new hot knit yarn yarns so i left it in the bag so you guys can see this is how it comes in case you ever want to order and you're curious about it this is how orders come in in a plastic bag you guys ready are you guys ready for the big reveal so this is the some new stuff i want to show you from hot knit yarn Ooh, bam shabuya wabam wapa <laughs> look at that pop of color guys so these two beauties are called prism and this one is always selling out as soon as she puts it out so i'm pretty sure it's sold out already but you can check out her website and see if you can snag some this is in the fingering weight we're gonna open these so don't worry yeah so again superwash merino and nylon blend 463 yards so perfect three of them you can definitely make a nice loose sweater to accompany it in the lining i chose this one which is crimped hair the reason why I chose it was uh, based off of the photos, I needed something neon to go with these colors. And if you can see or see what I see, this one is actually a more faded pastel version of Prism minus the black. So that's why I like it. So if I planned this out correctly, if I use the middle color for detailing, it should make the whole sweater come together and it should give it a nice grid circuit board computer board type of techno feel which is what I'm going for now let's open these beauties okay so this first one is prism I don't rip labels I try to be as careful with them as possible I hoard labels too unfortunately but eventually I do end up throwing it away ready Shelly, that's the name of the dyer. Shelly, this is so cool. This is so nice. Even on camera, that looks so wicked and weird. Let me go ahead and shift the colors for you so you can see. Look at that. That's cool, huh? Ooh. Ooh, just dripping in color. This section the most. I'm a sucker for neons like this. I call them Hawaiian techno neons, where it's like a Hawaiian sunset, but with the black tie-dye stuff effect. But really nice, Shelly. Very cool. Very cool concept. Yarn one, done. Let's do crimped hair. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> so this is a very pastel -y, but I really am I'm putting all of my cards on this neon section. I'm hoping the neon of this colorway really brings prism together. Sometimes you just won't know until you do it and you can't see it, but we'll see. Because this could easily go for like a cotton can. So this is crimped hair. Let me show you how it goes. So we go from a nice neon yellow green to all of that. Look at that beautiful color. Ooh, very good. You see, do you see my vision? Do you see them coming together? <laughs> All right, let's see if, let's see how similar this third prism is. So just like with any kind of yarn that you purchase and is hand dyed, everything will always be unique and different. Not everything will always come out the same. Look at that. So this one definitely has more color solids in it and it's a little bit more saturated as well could you imagine if i dyed my hair this color isn't it cool i should right i should consider dyeing my hair this color now wait a minute make sure you like and subscribe to this channel if you enjoy what you're watching it tells me what you like but also it helps support me as well to continue to grow and dedicate time to do this for you so with my cup of coffee cheers to hitting that subscribe button also, don't forget to make sure that the bell notifications is on for all. If you do not hit all, it will not tell you every single time I upload a video. It will decide when it wants to tell you. So make sure you change that little bell to all. And make sure it's on when you subscribe to my channel. Cool. So, final thoughts. Uh, I have bought from Hanya Yarns before. The, her colorways are just very unique and they have a nice cool uh touch to it very saturated and i think it's very worth the money that you're paying for the yarn isn't pilly it does not feel cheap it is on the thin side so just keep that in mind all there's other fingering weights that's a little bit thicker but this one is this one's on the thin side also shipping she ships out twice a week and her schedule's changing but she's still maintaining that cool consistency so you will get this in less than a week for sure when you place an order Follow her on Instagram because when she updates her shop, she's very good at letting you know when she updates and what exactly she's updating. And she is hustling. So she's always bringing back in stock what you guys are asking for, which is always, always great and appreciated when it comes to hand dyers. Yes, I, I, I totally get it. You want to take a break and you want to release collections, but I do appreciate someone who's always constantly updating their shop in little batches so that way everyone can make sure that they get some of it. I cannot wait to show you guys what I'm excited to do with this. This will be very, we'll see. I don't know. Sometimes you just got to let the colors inspire you as you use it. And it's very different when you see it online to when you get it in person. Don't forget to like and subscribe once again. Thank you so much. Shout out to Shelly, Hot Knit Yarns. Make sure you follow her. But yeah, hopefully you enjoy these yarns. And if you consider buying or anything, make sure you let her know that I sent you her way. All right, I'll see you in the next video.